Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So yes, it is that time again. Time to take up another champion. We've got a rank four to take up today, and I'm kind of excited about this one. So if you think you can guess who it is that I'm about to take up, feel free to leave a comment below. I think I went through several uh, champions that I was thinking of taking up. And I bought the first package of the romance store for like, uh, I bought it twice for 9,000 units. And that gave me, I believe, uh, the resources for um, two rank fours. I also got a three to four rank up gem. So I'm gonna have some fun. But anyway, leave a comment below if you think you know who I'm gonna take up right now. But we're about to reveal it in five, four, three, two, one. Absorbing Man, that's right. So he is the champion that I wanted the most out of the featured. Yes, I wanted I Doom as well, but I Doom I wanted more for prestige. And you know, he's a decent champion too but it was Absorbing Man that I really wanted, okay? And uh, towards the end of the video, you'll see some of the reasons why I wanted Absorbing Man more than any other champion in that featured pool. But I have not used him outside of Arena. So we will be playing around with him together. Uh, but he is amazing. I have seen videos on him. I've seen some of the damage he is capable of doing. I probably won't be doing that crazy damage that I saw, but I'm going to try. I'm going to see uh, what he's able to do. Uh, I saw some of his synergies, and we're going to talk about his synergies later as well. But while I'm ranking him up, I want to tell you guys what I had to go through. So, like I said, I bought the package for, um, it was, a, uh, I think it was three each. And um, that would give me two, right? But it didn't contain any T5 basics, and I was out of them. So, I needed T5 basics. Um, I looked, and I saw that I could take two champions to rank four that were already rank three. And then I could also use the three to four rank up gem. So I was like, okay, um, looks like I just need some T5 basics. But I really wanted to take up Absorbing Man. The problem was that he needed T4 basics to get him to at least rank two and he also needed T5 basics. So I looked around and T4 basics are not difficult to come by if you wanna spend your units. I didn't really wanna spend my units, so I was looking all over the place. Uh, I actually went into the Battleground store. I bought some there uh, after you know running a few Battleground matches to get the tokens. And uh, as far as the T5 basics went, uh, I had opened up a bunch of the uh, Paragons uh, a while back. But this time, I went through the side quest. Um, I think I did a few of the uh, event quests. Wherever I could find T5 basics or fragments or whatever, any crystals I could find, I opened them up. So then... After I had done all of this and I had, you know, some decent amount, I noticed I did not have a tier five mystic class catalyst. And I needed that to get him to rank three. If I could get him to rank three, I could use the rank up gem to get him to rank four. But without a T5 class catalyst, I couldn't do it. So I was like, oh boy, maybe I'm not going to be able to do this 
uh, video for today. I might have to do the other two and then on the next level up. But I was stubborn. And so I started looking around for ways to get that T5 class catalyst. I opened up all my crystals. I had like five percenters, uh, 10 percenters, all of that. And guess what? Not a single one gave me Mystic. Ain't that how it goes? Not a single one. Opened up one, it was like, -da -da, all the classes except Mystic. I said, okay, I see. Uh, so I looked around and um, I think I, I found some fragments. Uh, where did I find some fragments? It was, it was some uh, choice ones. And I think I, I got them from the Battlegrounds. They had some. And I think I got it from the Loyalty. So I was tapped out. But I was able to get the T5 Mystic formed. Couldn't get a full one, but I finally got one formed from all the fragments that I managed to, you know, get and, and piece together. And I was so happy. So I said, all right, good, 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 good. And now I'm able to take him up the way that I wanted to take him up. So uh, a big struggle. And I was tempted also to wait for the final um, event in case it was a mystic advancement. It wasn't. Um, but I decided not to wait, actually. Um, but I waited too late to really do the video, so um, that's why I'm doing it this morning rather than having done it last night and then um, having it ready this morning. Uh, I just went to bed. Uh, I looked and uh, I saw that the final event wasn't, it was another combat event. That seems to be the way that they're doing it um, very rarely now. And very rarely you, you, will you get the advancement and the um, level up, so you could double dip. Since they upgraded the rewards, that's been the case. Now that they know people might want to. But all that I would be missing out on is a T4 class catalyst selector. And I had already done a bunch of those in order to get the T4 mystics that i needed in order to take him up because i had been tapped out so we got done with all of that all right and let me tell you i was i was uh smiling from ear to ear uh absorbing man uh all that i've seen of him uh he's gonna be a fun champion and uh i looked at his uh, signature ability. And while I wouldn't say that you absolutely have to have him awakened, he's still crazy good, even unawakened. You want him awakened. And you want him at SIG 200. And I will be working to get him to SIG 200. Uh, I don't have a ton of Mystic. I think I have 10 Mystic um signature stones uh and i'm saving my generics hoping to get i doom because i'll want to take him to sig 200 because that's mainly the reason that i would be getting him uh and and leveling him up is for his prestige so i definitely want him at sig 200 but i also want absorbing man at sig 200 so in the uh battleground store that is what I will be buying um, after a while. Once I got these guys up, um, like Absorbing Man is up there. And um, I think I have a couple other champs I want to get up there. I will stop getting the rank up materials from the Battleground store and just start getting Sig Stones. Um, <clears throat> before that, I had been getting a lot of um, Six Star uh, Shards because I was saving up for the feature. But now I need to get some Sig Stones so I could get these guys uh, to Sig 200. Uh, but anyway, uh, that is the rank up portion of the video. We're gonna go into Realm of Legends and play around with Winter Soldier a little bit. Like I said, I don't really know uh, how to use Absorbing Man 
Um, but we're going to play around with him a little bit, and we're going to look at his synergies as well. So be right back. All right, before we go in, I want to take a little bit of time to show you these synergies I have active, because let me tell you, they are awesome. I was, I was actually surprised when I looked over it. So we've got Titania. Now, what I often look at in the synergies is not just what the synergy brings, but who the synergy is with. And Titania, I also have it ranked four. She's a beast. And this gives Absorbing Man medium and heavy attacks, gain 600 critical damage rating. I can easily see myself bringing Titania along with Absorbing Man on a team. That is insane. Okay. And Titania gains an immunity to bleed effects. I am running the ouchy masteries and i always run them that is crazy that's crazy good okay next one up his second medium inflicts an armor break so that's more damage and it stacks five times and lasts for nine seconds nine seconds is pretty long and you're doing combos okay so that is crazy good Here's another one. While at or below a 15 combo meter, he's going to gain 1,000 block proficiency. So he'll be taking less damage in his block. But while he's above, he's going to gain critical rating. Crazy. Now, this particular one, I don't, you know, I don't even have him as a six star, as you see. Um, but I probably wouldn't be bringing this guy along. So that's a synergy that you probably would not see. But check this one out. This one is my favorite because I run the Ouchie Masteries. So Absorbing Man already starts in, um, he's bleed immune when he starts out. So that already takes care of the double edge uh, debuff. But then with this synergy, and look at who it's with, Eye Bomb and Immortal Hulk. Easily two good champions that I could see myself bringing on a team. And now he gains immunity to poison. That's crazy. So he is now even more ouchy mastery friendly. We're trying to be nice to the YouTube algorithm. And I was watching, I was looking at this and I was like, man, that is sweet. So let's uh, go in here, and we're just going to fight a little bit. Uh, there are other videos if you want to really uh, get a feel for how good he is. But um, I know that you're supposed to be able to do some uh, light intercepts, especially against this guy here. I don't know. So let's just uh, fire off his... Um, Special one. Okay. We'll fire off his special two. Look at those crits. Look at those crits. Oh, boy. And the more armor breaks you put on him, I want to see how... Yeah. He didn't take hardly any damage right there. Love it. Ugh. Okay, so he's in a morph. I can't, uh, let me see. Will he go? Hey, got one. Got a light attack in. Got another one in. What you know? Now, I saw someone do this. Let me try a heavy into a special whoa oh ugly ugly oh i'm liking this i'm definitely liking this guy y'all see that look look at the incinerate oh my goodness that's crazy that is crazy all right we go we, we gonna stop there we gonna stop there that that is insane uh, i don't want the video to be too long 
Uh, but that was crazy. Uh, and I and I think he also has he can heal as well. Um, but oh my goodness. Anyway, that is gonna do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Uh, you will see him again. Do not worry about that. All right. So take care, and you all have a blessed day. Thank you.